Today is August 20th and I'm Alan Wood. We're nine miles west of London, Ontario. Today we're going to uh, kind of recap what happened uh, this growing season so far. Our planting season started on time about mid-May when we planted our Roundup Ready to Extend soybeans and we did have a considerable amount of rain in June which caused some issues for a slower root development and uh, plant health did suffer. Uh, July and August to date have been good growing conditions. We've had the heat in July along with some timely rains. The crop is looking very good at this point. We, uh, we are uh, experiencing some insect issues. We've had uh, bean leaf beetle and currently we're monitoring for uh, aphids. Uh, we've been doing some spraying for aphids and watching the, the rest of the farms. We are watching the fields closely though and hoping that the uh, beneficial uh, insects like ladybugs are able to keep up with the, uh, the aphid population and we won't have to spray. The season so far has been uh, excellent for weed control. We went in with a pre-plant application of glyphosate and dicamba and then followed up with an in-crop application at uh, lower rates of dicamba and glyphosate. We've been very pleased with the Roundup Ready Extend crop system. We find that we've got an upper hand on the hard to get weeds, that uh, with the, the combination of the two products together uh, is giving us residual, which we need. The, uh, the spray timing uh, has opened up that window as well. That uh, we haven't found any issues with spray drift, that uh, with the right nozzle selection, and to be diligent on when we're spraying, that uh, we've had good results. The other thing that we're diligent on is our sprayer clean out, that we do the triple rinse method, and just to ensure that we don't have product carrying over into the next crop. We're looking forward to harvest this fall. This time of year, we're able to look at our crop, have an idea of what to expect. Things look excellent at this point and we're excited about, uh, about harvest this fall.